In today's video, I'll be showing you how to hide apps on your iPad. Now, as long as you're running iOS 18 and later versions, Apple added the option to, uh, to hide apps on your iPad as well as on your iPhone. So on your iPad, let's say you want to hide YouTube. You can see it right here on the home screen and you can even launch it with no problems at all. So if you want to hide this app, all you have to do is long press on the app icon and then tap on require face ID. Now on the require face ID pop-up menu, you can see we have the option to either just require face ID, which is basically the option to lock apps, but also you can lock and hide. So the second option there says hide and require face ID. So this is going to lock and also hide that particular application. So what you want to do is select hide and require face ID. It's going to scan your face, confirm that you want to hide up and the app disappears from the home screen as you can see it's nowhere to be seen now in case someone else comes and tries to find the app and even goes to the library they will not see uh, the youtube application or any app that you've hidden okay so as you can see it's nowhere to be found although there's a folder here in the app library which is hidden and it requires face id to be able to access that particular folder but as long as you don't have a face id or a passcode you'll not be able to access the hidden folder which is where all hidden files are saved or i mean hidden apps are saved so that's basically how to hide apps so to unhide just go to the app library at the bottom in the bottom tile there you'll see hidden tap on it and scan your face or put in a passcode that's going to reveal all the hidden apps and then you can tap on the app you want to unhide tap on it and you can use it if you wanted to use it okay now to unhide it just open that folder and then long press on the app icon and then select don't require face id and it's going to be removed from that particular folder and sent back to the home screen it's actually sent back to the app library so from here you can long press on it and drag it back to any of your home screens so that's basically how to unhide an app that you had hidden thanks for watching leave your comments and questions down below and good luck